The moisture management test methods that have been covered so far have dealt with the amount, distances, and time of water movement. The next test methods are those associated with the drying of water from fabrics. AATCC Test Method 199, Drying Time of Textiles, Moisture Analyzer Method, is intended to evaluate the drying time of fabrics using a gravimetric moisture analyzer equipped with a heating element. Drying rates can be influenced by temperature, humidity, and velocity of air movement, not to mention the many variations in physical characteristics of fabrics, such as fiber content, density, type of weave, and knit construction. For test method 199, a fixed amount of water is applied to a test specimen that is then dried at 37 degrees Celsius, which simulates the body temperature at which perspiration starts. The heating element of a moisture analyzer allows for other temperatures to be selected to simulate other conditions to which a garment might be exposed. A preliminary step for this test method is to determine whether the fabric is absorbent by using AATCC test method 79 absorbency of textiles. Another preliminary step is to determine the moisture retention of a fabric sample. A specimen is weighed in grams, then submerged in distilled water for one minute, removed from the water, and re-weighed to get a saturated weight in grams. From this determination, a volume of water is derived that will be applied to each test specimen. The endpoint of the test is to be agreed upon before testing is initiated. The endpoint may be when the dry weight of the specimen is reached, or some other value such as the dry weight plus 4% moisture content of the fabric. The last value is based on the truth that we never wear clothing in an environment that has no moisture or relative humidity. The test uses 70 millimeter diameter specimens. The test method entails the tearing removing the combined weight of the test instrument support platform and a wire screen as the zero starting point of the analyzer. Once the tear function has been done, a specimen is placed on the support platform and a circular screen wire is placed on top of the specimen. Then the predetermined volume of distilled water is applied over the entire surface of the specimen. The analyzer, with its analytical software, automatically terminates the test when the selected endpoint is reached. The average drying time in minutes of the specimens is recorded. 